and Breer had a brilliant idea when they set out to design the Phenom 300. They noticed that customers who were interested in the Phenom 100 wanted something even better, a bigger and more advanced aircraft. With this in mind, the designers went to work, making key enhancements to the original concept. They started by taking the basic fuselage cross-section of the Phenom 100 and extending it by an additional 14 inches. But that wasn't all. They also introduced a brand new wing design and incorporated powerful yet quiet Pratt & Whitney Canada turbofan engines into the mix. These improvements completely revolutionized the light private jet segment. Phenom 300 now boasts state-of-the-art avionics, making it an absolute joy to fly during cruising. Not only that, but it also stands out as an incredibly cost-effective choice for short to medium-haul flights. In terms of certifications, the Phenom 300 received the stamp of approval from the European Aviation Safety Agency in May 2010. It also passed the rigorous assessments of the civil aviation authorities in Indonesia, Australia, and India in February, July, and September 2011. With certifications from a total of 40 countries including Denmark, France, Morocco, the UK, South Africa, and the UAE, this aircraft is truly global in its reach. Impressively, the Phenom 300 can be flown by a single pilot and offers a range of nearly 2,000 nautical miles. It can reach a maximum speed of 453 knots and climb to a ceiling of 45,000 feet in just 26 minutes. These performance capabilities position it as a strong contender against the pricier Bombardier Learjet 40XR and the Cessna Citation CJ4. It might even discourage Hawker Beechcraft from launching their highly anticipated Hawker 450 XP, which was supposed to be the successor to the renowned Beech Jet. From a marketing perspective, the Phenom 300 is what we call a category killer. Despite its small size, the private jet has all the amenities your colleagues need for their business trips. The cabin may be compact, measuring just 5.1 feet wide and 4.9 feet tall, but its stretch is a generous 17.2 feet in length. And when it comes to interior design, some people compare it to a well-equipped BMW and for good reason. Embraer collaborated with the automaker to ensure a sleek and stylish aesthetic. The newer models in particular offer an array of impressive features. You can choose from a wide selection of interior color options and even the cabin supports plated window shades, ultra leather sidewalls, carpet or wood flooring and beautifully finished galley cabinets and externally serviced aft lavatory. When it comes to floor plans, the Phenom 300 offers two primary options, each with its own set of customizable features. You can choose to include a full wardrobe or a sink in the lavatory, and the galley is equipped with convenient amenities like a hot jug and a wine rack. As for storage, the aircraft boasts five spacious baggage compartments, totaling 74 cubic feet. These compartments have interior dimensions that can accommodate full-length skis and are easily accessible from within the aircraft. The Phenom 300 delivers with the latest in-flight entertainment options. You can enjoy satellite radio and each passenger seat is equipped with its own power outlet. The stereo system is compatible with MP3 players ensuring that you can listen to your favorite tunes. Additionally, separate passenger and cockpit temperature controls are available, allowing everyone to enjoy their preferred level of comfort throughout the flight. For those who chose the Phenom 300E upgrade, smart storage solutions have been implemented to optimize cabin space. Each seat is equipped with 12-inch deep drawers, perfect for storing personal belongings. Other upgrades include USB charging outlets, 7-inch video screens, and Bluetooth connectivity, enhancing the overall passenger experience. Embraer's 2017 updates aim to provide the ultimate customer experience in business aviation. The cabin is designed to maximize natural lighting thanks to 11 windows that flood the space with sunlight during daytime flights. Customization options are also available such as the two-place dive-in and accommodating club seating. In summary, if you're seeking a modern, luxurious, and comfortable interior at a light jet pricing point, the Phenom 300 is sure to meet your expectations. While the 300E boasts enhancements in performance, comfort, and technology, the success of the entire Phenom 300 series lies in its foundation of power and precision. As outlined in the technical specifications provided on Embraer's website, every Phenom 300 is equipped with two highly impressive Pratt & Whitney Canada PW535E turbofan engines. In the 300 models, each engine generates a substantial 3,360 pounds of thrust. However, the 300E takes it up a notch, offering an increased thrust of 3,478 pounds per engine. These engines not only deliver remarkable power, but also excel in efficiency. They minimize the noise footprint, achieve superior fuel economy, and produce fewer emissions compared to competing aircraft. Furthermore, the powerful engines combined with an innovative winglet design enable rapid climb rates of up to 3,000 feet per minute. The aircraft's relatively short takeoff field length, standing at 3,209 feet, compared 
compared to the CJ4's 3,410 foot requirement, adds to its impressive performance capabilities. One of the standout features of the Phenom 300 series is its exceptional performance in challenging conditions such as steep slope approaches and high altitude locations like Telluride, Colorado. The versatility allows the aircraft to access a wider range of airstrips in various locations, reducing wasted ground travel time and expenses. Embraer has received an overwhelming response for the Phenom family with over 800 firm orders to date. Approximately two-thirds of these orders are for the Phenom 100, while the remaining one-third is for the Phenom 300. Notable deliveries include one to Executive Flight Services in December 2009, an order placed by an ABC Taxi Heroine in August 2006, four ordered by Eagle Creek Aviation Services in October 2006 with an option for five more, and an order of six from Executive Airshare, with the first delivery taking place in July 2010. In May of 2010, Cleveland-based Flight Options received the first of 100 Phenom 300s that were ordered. The first delivery to South Africa occurred in September 2010, and in October 2010, John McCormick of McCormick Property Developments took delivery of the aircraft. Matt Jetson and Embraer signed a contract for 50 Phenom 300 aircraft with an additional 75 options, with deliveries scheduled to commence in 2013. In February 2011, Emil Assistancia Medica of Brazil placed an order for one Medivac version of the Phenom 300 set to be delivered in the last quarter of 2011. Additionally, Recon Group ordered one Phenom 300 executive jet in May 2011. The Phenom 300 has certainly lived up to its promises, according to Terry Vance, a retired motorcycle drag racing champion who now ventures into various motorcycle-related businesses. Vance, who received the second U.S.-based Phenom 300 in January, had already accumulated 115 flight hours by the end of June. He expressed his belief that the aircraft has the potential to become an iconic choice in terms of customer satisfaction. Embraer has just made the 55 Chevy, he said. I think the 300 might be a home run. The first delivery of the Phenom 300 took place in December to Executive Flight Service, which operates the aircraft on a Part 135 charter certificate for a Texas-based customer. Executive Airshare, EFS's sister company, offers fractional shares in the aircraft and has six on order. Adam Letts, Vice President of Operations at EFS and a pilot in command, has logged approximately 127 hours in the Phenom 300. He believes the aircraft is about 98% of the way to perfection. Both Vance and Letts agree that the Phenom 300 is a game changer, offering passengers more legroom and a 20% reduction in fuel burn compared to the beach jet. It also boasts an impressive sustained climb rate of 4,000 feet per minute and powerful brakes that can bring the aircraft to a stop in as little as 2,200 feet after touchdown. Despite lacking thrust reversers and having limited full flap settings at 26 degrees, operators have commended the Phenom 300 for its remarkable stopping power. In its earlier models, the Phenom 300 featured the Garmin Prodigy G1000 avionics suite, which has now been upgraded to the newer Prodigy Touch G3000. The Phenom 300E in particular is the first aircraft to be equipped with this cutting-edge touchscreen technology, which is especially convenient for single pilots. All Phenom 300 models come with a three-panel display, but the 300E's displays are slightly larger. Alongside the high-tech touchscreen avionics system, Embraer has retained traditional push buttons and twist knobs to operate tasks such as the intercom, transponder, checklist, and flight plan entry. The differences between the 300 and 300E are relatively minor as the newest upgrade performs similarly to earlier models. However, expect interior enhancements in both the cabin and cockpit, creating a distinct contrast when compared to earlier versions. The Phenom 300 features the advanced Garmin G3000 avionics system, which encompasses a range of impressive functionalities. This includes surface watch, vertical navigation, wind shear alerting, weather radar with vertical scan, ground clutter suppression, and turbulence detection. In addition, the latest upgrades incorporate a variety of valuable features such as the runway overrun awareness and alerting system, predictive wind shear, synthetic vision system, emergency descent mode, PERT, and FAA datacom, among others. These enhancements contribute to a safer and more efficient flying experience for pilots. Both generations of the Phenom 300 series offer pilots a smooth and enjoyable flight. While the fly-by-wire system may require some adjustment, the incorporation of electric brakes, spoilers, and ailerons ensures consistent stopping performance, particularly on short runways. 
This technology surpasses the capabilities of traditional hydraulic braking systems, and the aircraft's advanced features also enable safe landings at a steep slope airport like London City, which does have a 5.5 degree glide slope instead of the typical 3 degree slope during approach. The acquisition cost of the Phenom 300 typically ranges from $9 million, with the price varying depending on the production year. For newer production models, the cost may exceed the given range. On average, buyers can expect to spend around $800,000 per year, which covers expenses such as fuel, crew members, and maintenance. For those considering pre-owned options, the price range can fall between $5 to $6 million. Numerous sellers can be found on various online platforms, providing potential buyers with a wide selection of choices. Overall, the Phenom 300 offers a comprehensive package of advanced avionics, impressive performance, and cost-effective operations, making it a highly desirable choice for individuals and companies in the private jet market. Check out this video next.